YouTube, what is going on? Hope you are doing well. Happy October, the final stretch of the year. Last three months to go. Uh, just had a call this morning talking with some of my clients about, you know, prepping, planning, you know, setting themselves up for success for the next, you know, um, final push to wrap up 2022. And kind of wanted to share some things, things that I've been, you know, progressing through, but also give you guys value here um, is the idea of like we always hear you're one decision away from a totally different life, right? And I want to break that down here for you. Is like, what does that really mean, right? What does that mean, that one decision? And kind of to give it in a simpler terms for you guys to be able to implement into your own life, right? And with the call that we had today, you know, discussing how we can really be able to set those decisions is like people that joined my program, right, made that one decision to invest into themselves, to put themselves out there, to hop on a call, to answer one of my messages, to ultimately join into the program. And it's like by making that one decision, now they're able to get the support from me for a lifetime, hopping on weekly calls, um, being a part of our private Facebook group, getting access to all new material and old material inside of our main program, right? And it's like what that started, right, when they first answered my message or commented, you know, on one of my posts is they started that domino effect in their life by showing up and saying, hey, I'm interested, started the conversation of hopping on a call. By hopping on a call, they were able to see what was capable, what is out there for them to be able to give them the support and transformation that they need. And then ultimately saying yes to the program now gave them access to everything that I have, you know, to offer. And it doesn't need to be for me, for your life. You know, you could be, you know, learning marketing. You guys could be learning sales. You guys could be learning content creation. You guys could be learning just business overall, right? You guys could be learning how to play a piano, right? And it's like those small steps build up to getting you to where you want to be. And I want to kind of talk about that domino effect because it's so true that it's already Thursday and I've been to the gym, you know, once so far, right? So you're probably saying, hey, four days in there, I'm supposed to be, you know, the most disciplined um, person that I can try to be, but things get tough, you know, and what held me back from going to the gym, you know, as I try to use this as feedback and to grow from it was probably not being dialed in with, you know, my nutrition, not tracking, you know, things that the way I should and now that affects different areas of my life, right? And if I'm not working out, right, how am I feeling? Where's my energy at, right? And now last week I had the most calls ever um, in my 12 months of doing business and that kind of gave me more feedback. Hey, you know what? I'm starting to lose some energy as the day goes on as I hopped on my third, fourth, fifth call and one day I had seven calls right? A lot of calls, a lot of conversations to be had. And now that feedback for me is I need to start to take my nu nutrition a lot more serious, right? I need to be able to focus on those areas. And for you, right, to start that domino effect, there's a uh, popular quote. I'm pretty sure it's from Atomic Habits. It's like every yes is a vote for the person that you want to become, right? Every yes is a vote for the person that you want to become, Every time you say yes to waking up and getting out of bed without hitting snooze, every time you say yes to going to the gym, every time you say yes to planning at the end of your day when you're tired, overwhelmed, and all you want to do is just watch TV, when you say yes to putting your phone down and removing those distractions, right? All crucial, crucial, crucial things that are going to get you where you want to go if you can continue to say yes. And in our mind, and what I talked about you know, this morning on our group call is... We want to find that balance. So often we go to the year timeline. Hey, in a year, where do I want to be? Right? And it's like, if we don't do stuff this week, we're just like, oh, it's okay. I have a year. Right? Like, oh, next year I'm going to be doing this. Oh, next year I want to be here. But it's like, if we're not able to do those same things right now, then in a year from now, unfortunately, a lot of times what happens is we find ourselves in that same spot. Right? So to kind of bring that a small scale, if every yes we do, you know, can say or do is a vote for the person that we want to become is like, how can you win today? Right? You might have five opportunities, right? Maybe three of those opportunities are your meals, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Maybe you've been eating unhealthy. Well, hey, maybe you could say yes to one healthier meal. Maybe it's not a win for the day because you didn't get a majority, you know, yes or, or vote in there for yourself, but it starts that domino effect. 
because you're saying yes to a healthier meal, before, because you're saying yes to going to the gym, kicking things back off, the rest of those you know pieces begin to fall into place much, much, much easier, right? And it's like people always say, oh, you're lucky, oh, this. It's just because people show up and do the work where it's like when opportunities pop up, they're ready for it, right? Because they constantly say yes for themselves. So to put that in another way is... If we are constantly saying, right, say we say, hey, I'm going to wake up at 5 o'clock, go to the gym. Alarm, alarm goes off 5 o'clock, we say no. Now the next day we say no. Now the next day we say no. We are building subconsciously that habit to tell ourselves, hey, it's okay to sleep in. Hey, it's okay to not go to the gym. Hey, it's okay to push this off. And it becomes easier to say no, even though our mind's like, come on, let today be the day. Come on, stand up out of bed. It becomes easier to say no, right? To put our pressure or put our energy into that way. But if we can break that pattern even just once, right? Going back to the very beginning of this video, you are um, one decision away from, you know, a totally different life is that one vote of yes can change everything. Because now what you're doing, again, is you're showing yourself, hey, I'm capable of doing this. Hey, I'm capable of doing that. And when you see results start to fall too, when you start to see everything come together, now that yes becomes even more driven, even more easy. Because now you're supporting that vision and now you're showing up for yourself. Right, so wanted to share that little bit. This is a quick video. Um, I'm excited for next week's video. I do have uh, something I want to give you guys to be able to help you out on your journey. So, if that's something you're interested in, if you're looking to track your habits a little bit better, if you're looking to track your progress a little bit closer, then definitely check out next week's video. But I will see you then. Appreciate you guys checking out my video. Keep crushing it. Happy October.